the newest edition of Debbie C TV, where Debbie C shines great news less time. We'd like to remind everyone that prom is rapidly approaching. Prom will be April 25th in the new gym. If you'd like to purchase your tickets, visit Miss Powell or Miss Kurtzinger's room. So ladies, get your prom dresses and gents, get your prom puzzles together. We would like to extend a congratulations to the following January Students of the Month. Freshman Jamie Taylor. Sophomore Ann Taylor Redman. Junior Claire Miller. And senior Anthony Osborne. Now join us for the latest sports update with our sports commentator Terrence Churchill and Lexi Thompson. On January 31st, we will host the basketball homecoming game. Come out and support the girls and boys as they face the Adair County Indians. Girls tip off at 6 and boys play at 7.30. Also come and support the homecoming nominees at 7.15 and see who will be crowned senior basketball homecoming king and queen. This is WC The Spotlight. I'm Terrence Churchill here with the player of the week, Zach Graves. So, uh, how long have you been playing basketball? I've been playing since about since I was about five or six years old. So I gotta know, what are your funniest basketball moments? Well, I have a lot of them whenever Justin throws the ball behind his back to Cameron and smacks him in the face or throws it to Justin Campbell and that one time when it smacked him in the face in practice. But my funniest basketball moment out of my four years has to be when Justin got swatted by Savon over in Barstown last year. It was it was crazy. <laughs> Shots fired. Finally, what's your favorite part about basketball? Well, I'd have to say that I get to hanging out with my teammates. And other than that, there's not really a favorite part. Basketball is just part of my life, and I've always liked playing it. Well, that's it with our player of the week, Zach Graves. I'm Lexi Thompson here with Asia England, the girls' basketball player of the week. I'd like to congratulate you and ask you a couple questions. How old were you when you started playing basketball? I was 10. What are your strengths and weaknesses in basketball? My strengths is shooting threes and my weaknesses is driving to the basketball. What was your favorite basketball memory? My favorite basketball memory was going to the Marion County Autism Classic and eating after the games. Thank you, Daisha, and good luck with your future basketball career. Thanks. Senior night will be Friday, February 6th against Cumberland County. Girls tip at 6. Boys play at 7.30. On the next day, join us as we play our rivals, Marion County, on February 7th. Girls tip at 6, boys at 7.30. The baseball team will be having a chili supper this Saturday during the homecoming basketball game in the school cafeteria. Adults can eat for $7, children eat for 4 Make sure to come out. Listen up, students. It's Commander Code! With homecoming and senior night coming up, we're going to talk about the most important sixth man, the student section. To increase lower classroom participation would be to have fun games. And I think that if we all had cheers that everybody knew and would speak up and say them, and that would raise more spirit. And if we stood up and painted up, that would be cool. And decorated the gym. And built the hype up to the game starting in Monday. Like our theme week. Like we are this week. How can we increase participation at the basketball games? What do we think, Jimmy? Um, I think we need a leader. Somebody that's going to stand up. It's not to be afraid to be, you know, embarrassed. Stand up, have a lot of school spirit, and somebody that people are going to follow, you know? Yeah, be dumb. Don't be afraid to be crazy. Have some Man, fun. You know, get up, put your, do things with your hands, you know, scream. Get hey. up the refs, have some fun with it. Yeah. In the student section, you should look to the juniors and seniors to know what to do. Most of the time, they're going to be yelling derogatory names, which are okay as long as they're not too bad. Or they're going to start a chant. If, if a senior or a junior starts a chant, you have to go along with it. And since they're in the front row, they're leading it, so you just have to do what they do. All right, whenever you're trying to find the student section, you walk into the gym, and you just find where all students are that are acting stupid. The thing about the student section is, Seniors always get to sit on the front row. And when a senior does something crazy, you do it with them, like two claps and a reflect. Woo! I think our student section needs to get a lot better because it's very terrible. There's like five people there, and no matter how bad our team's doing, that we need to at least come and try to support them and have fun with it. It sucks. <laughs> bad. Come to the games, please. 
We could get themed games for people to participate in. And every like Thursday and Friday we could stay after school and like decorate for the games. People can make posters for players. We can just do like any little signs or anything that you can do to help for school spirit. Join us next time for our next edition of Commander Code. Homecoming will be this Saturday following the girls game at 7.15. The following are the basketball homecoming representatives for the 2014-2015 school year. Freshmen, Christopher Riley and Chastity Warner. Sophomores, Jesus Hernandez and Ann Taylor Redman. Juniors, Tanner Yates and Lauren Mattingly. And seniors, Olivia Kelly, Bethany Wheatley, Amanda DeWitt and Katie Carrico. Davon Moore, Jacob Howard, Anthony Osborne and Brad Taylor. Congratulations to all the representatives and good luck to seniors in the fight for homecoming king and queen. And now for your weekend weather forecast. Friday, January 30th, we have a high 33 with a low 22. Saturday, January 31st, we have a high 42 and a low 32. Sunday, February 1st, we have a high 37 and a low 16 with a 90% chance of rain and snow. Make sure you join us next time on WCTV. And your song of the week on iTunes is Thinking Out Loud by Ed Sheeran. When your legs don't work like they used to before And I can't sweep you off of your feet Will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Will your eyes still smile from your cheek? Darling, I will be loving you till we're 70. And baby, my heart could still.